Right off the top, new at 11, those criminal charges being considered against several corrections officers at the state's only youth prison. Good evening, everyone. Thank you for joining us tonight. I'm Zach Blanchard. That's according to state lawmakers on the legislature's Criminal Justice and Public Safety Committee. It comes after reports of dangerous use of restraint of incarcerated youth at Long Creek just weeks ago launched an internal investigation. One report detailed an officer allegedly throwing a resident to the ground. In a call with Department of Corrections Commissioner Randall Liberty yesterday, lawmakers say they heard much of the reports confirmed. Multiple sources confirming to News Center Maine three senior officials at the facility are resigning or being reassigned, and as many as seven officers could be facing charges. Independent Representative Bill Pluker says the alleged incidents are disturbing. I want to see the I want to see the video, and we have to know that this is not how we want to how we want our children being taken care of. Right at the end of the day, these are kids, and these are kids who deserve better. All of this has renewed calls to shut down the facility that currently houses as many as 40 young people. Department of Corrections would not comment tonight. A spokesperson for the governor's office did not immediately return our request.